In this video we're going to take a look at PhotoFlow on the Nokia 5800. Effectively it's an alternative for viewing images to the built-in gallery application. PhotoFlow is available by getting it from the download application. It's by a company called Scalado and as you can see here it allows you to browse through images on a carousel type basis fairly quickly. The other advantage is it allows you to zoom into the photo much more quickly than the standard gallery application. A triple tap on the screen takes you in and then you can move around. You can see here there's support for photo flicking to get around the image. Or alternatively you can use the small image thumbnail in the top corner to move around the image rapidly. Tapping on the image again zooms you back out. As you can see the performance of photo flow is much more impressive than the built-in gallery particularly when it comes to zooming into images. This is because it uses Scalado's CAPS imaging technology We've written plenty about this technology on the site before. It's been demonstrated at the last few Symbian smartphone shows, Mobile World Congress and other events. However, this is the first time I've seen the technology available easily to end users. It works in a number of ways, including an improved JPEG codec and using less device resources, i.e. less memory and processor power. It can be used much more widely too, for example in zero shutter lag cameras, but here it's in viewing photos. You'll notice I've been using the touch screen to navigate through the photos, but you can also use the volume controls on the top of the device. From a general point of view, what I think is interesting about PhotoFlow is it demonstrates very effectively how important software engineering is in the performance of mobile devices. It's all too easy to focus on CPU speed or memory, but what I hope I've shown here is that software can be just as important. For 5800 owners who are looking for this application, you can get it from download as I mentioned before. It's available in the imaging folder.